50 seconds to the launch. See, it's so separated. Now, the rocket is in standalone mode, ready for launch and ignition. So at this stage, the rocket is on its own. The navigation is 30 seconds to yeah. go. So, this is a video from the drone. I've never been seen this. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Ignition. Lift off. Pitch over means that it has already changed its direction from vertical direction uh, to the to a certain woods. angle, right? We yeah. can we can also see that from yeah, yeah. a, a far to the, shore. to the eastward. Yes. So this the Shenzhou 16. So this is a video mount with uh, from the camera mounted on the core stage. Right. And this is an infrared image. You are watching live footage on the launch of the Shenzhou 16 spacecraft to China Space Station. And the next uh, critical step will be the jettisoning of the emergency escape tower. Right. Again, this is infrared. We, we can see a clear ang angle change, right? Yeah. So it's flying uh, eastward. So will there be still some adjustment of the angle uh, yeah. to the uh, forty-one point five degree, as uh, you earlier mentioned? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So mm. the inclination. So this is mm. uh, you can see the two of the boosters. Uh, there are four in total, there are right? Four. Yeah. So this is there are two on this yeah, side. Yeah, just from one side. Yeah. Should be able to see it uh, when separation. Right. Yeah. So the uh, emergency is Cape Town will be just jettisoned soon. You can see some light sparks on the top of the rocket uh, when it's injected. Right. Yeah. And on the right side of the screen is the, the, the simulation. 3D, uh, simula 3D simulation. simulation. But it is yes. driven by the real data. The real data, of Which course. means that the position and the OK, okay jettison. Now, uh, the jettison of the escape tower. Yeah. And the next step will be separation of the four boosters. Right. Let's uh, wait Great. for those uh, step by step. Followed by separation of the fairing. The G forces mm. acting on the bodies of the astronauts are increasing. Mm. We, can still the, we can see the burning mark yeah. on, on yeah, the yeah, engines, yeah. right? So they, they, they are, right now it's really high into the atmosphere, okay. right? Okay, separate it. Okay, separation of the four engines. And the core stage is also separated. Core stage separated. So this is again the infrared image. We can see the very clear the mm. four boosters and the first stage. Mm. They've already separated from. The now it's already uh, on the working of the second stage. Second stage. As I mentioned, it has one main engine and four Vernier engines. Right. <laughs> oh, <laughs> they, they, they say they, they feel so comfortable. Yeah. Yeah. That, they're talking. Oh, oh. I think uh, they've done the max Q, which is the maximum uh, gravity. They've so already done that. Yeah, they've already done it. So you can see this is a camera from the video mounted on the second stage. Second and, stage. And is this is a the camera in the payload ferry. Mm. <laughs> and the next uh, physic, uh, critical step will be the jettisoning of the payload ferry. Okay. It's, it's all done. It's jettisoned. Already done. Yeah. Now they can see the uh, side scenes they can see from the, the window. Yes. Yeah, they can see that. Yes. So are they out of the uh, atmosphere yes. right yes. now? Exactly. So can we say they're already in outer space? Yes. You're watching live footage from inside the Shenzhou 16 spacecraft. The three Taikonauts are now in outer space, heading towards the China space station. On the left, uh, left side of the screen, uh, we can see the camera mounted still on the uh, on core stage. On the core stage. Yeah. The second Outside the core, core stage. Yeah. 
Mm. So this is working of the second stage of the Long March 2F mm. rocket vehicle. Still, the on the left of the screen is the infrared videos. Right. Uh, and the uh, second stage of the uh, Long March 2F works much longer than the first stage because it only uh, has one main engine uh, right. uh, with a thrust about 80 tons. Mm. This is an image of the, stage, uh, the second stage uh, engine. Mm. The main engine of the second stage is fixed and you can see that the small engine on the left uh, on the left corner, mm. the small warning engine can change its direction to control the trajectory. Okay, but uh, the main engine is a fixed its angle. Yeah, for okay. propulsion purpose. Yeah, right. And usually we separate the payload fairing at the attitude of about 100 kilometers. Mm. Uh, so at this moment, uh, according to the uh, definition... Uh, now we can s see again, yeah. live <laughs> streaming from inside the China Space Station. They are watching the live, yeah. live coverage. They're getting yeah. closer. They're getting closer and closer to their colleagues yeah. at this moment. And also on the uh, right bottom of the screen, we can see the 3D animation. Yeah. And also you can see the data link between the ground stations and the launch vehicle. OK, so three of them. Three, uh, yeah, these yeah. three ground stations. Three ground stations. At this moment, mm. they're constantly changing. Right. So they are experiencing the... It's also a relay stations. race between different uh, yeah. ground They have uh, a relay. Yeah. Yes. Uh, yes. And this is a video on the rear part of the second stage. Mm. It's, it's still working at this moment, It's right? all, still, still working. Burning. Mm. And the next uh, critical step will be the shutdown of the main engine. But the oh, we, we, we can see the Earth, right? Yes, yes it's very bright. So they're, they're now in outer space, and, and the second stage engine is still at work. Uh, what's, what's the next stage aim? Uh, they're, they're, Adjusting the position angles or, or yeah, 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 yeah. Mm. Uh, adjusting its trajectory. trajectory. Uh, you can see, although it is in daytime, mm. but the sky is black because mm. they were already in outer space yeah. in a vacuum condition. Yeah. So the rocket engine will take them to the right uh, velocity and right altitude right. Uh, and right orbit before there is a separation between the engine and the capsule itself. Mm. And then the, uh, the uh, final success will be uh, uh, will be indicated by the deployment of the solar array. Right. Wow. They yeah, are very relaxed. Yeah. Yes. The Shenzhou 15 crew are relaxed and happily waiting for their colleagues. But we can also see that uh, the three Titan nods uh, in Shenzhou 16 spacecraft they're also relaxed because they're well trained for this process. And so far, it's been a smooth process. Mr. Mr. Dr. Zhu Yang Zhu and uh, uh, Dr. Uh, Gui Hai Chao, mm. uh, at this moment, they are already qualified to be an astronaut because they are already uh, above In. the common line. Mm. About, uh, about common the, line? Yeah. Uh, it's a, it's a line professional is, uh, job. The, <laughs> the altitude is 100 kilometers. Okay. So that is the uh, uh, artificial uh, definition of the border of the outer space. Right. The final frontier, right? Yeah. Named yeah. under von Kármán. Yeah. Right. The renowned scientist. So what about staying time? What if you know someone just pass out Mars and re-enters? I think okay, the main engine is shut down. The second, second stage engine is now shut down. No, the uh the still the four Vernier engines are working. Okay. Oh, the main engine. Main, main engine is yeah, shut, shut down. Which means mm. they have reached the uh the velocity and the altitude already. Mm. Mm. And the Vernier engine will do some uh very precise adjustment of mm. the trajectory. Uh -huh. Still, we're watching live footage from the camera mounted on this second stage. Yeah. This is live stream from outer space. Yeah. Yes. And after shutdown of the Vernier engines, uh, next will be the separation of the launch vehicle and the Shenzhou spaceship. On the left, you can see this folded, folded uh, solar array. Uh, this is the a stack of the solar array mm. that has been folded in on the Shenzhou uh, spaceship. So at this moment, uh, the cabin is still powered by batteries or, or what? Yes, batteries. It's powered by, by batteries. Storage batteries. Storage batteries. Yes. And once uh, the solar panel is opened, then it can generate, generate. power by its own. Yes. Yeah. Yes. You can see yeah, on the ground the stations 3D are still animation. tracking, yeah. uh, tracking the, uh, the, uh, the flight. Yeah, from the uh, 3D animation at the bottom mm. right, you can see still that the four body engines are still working. Right. To adjust uh, the uh, trajectory. So when Professor Yang mentioned the burning engine, this is the process they take full advantage of the launch vehicle.
because the uh, Shenzhou itself has own, its own adjustment uh, system, but it's to take full advantage of the launch vehicle competence, and then after separation, uh, the Shenzhou is on itself for adjustment. Oh, they're, they're still definitely watching in the same position. So, yes, they're relaxed, but uh, they're still anxious to, 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 to they me, they're see calling the success the of the launch at least, yes. right? Yes. Well, we're also still yeah, yeah, yeah. anxiously yeah. waiting for that moment. Okay, shut down. Separation. Now, the engine has left the uh, spacecraft. Yes. So the spacecraft is on its own now. Uh, and the next step will be unfolding of the solar panels. Right. That means the launch vehicle has done its job. It has now completely left the spacecraft. The, uh, the job is done. The March 2F is done. Mm. It's 